time for the Longines Chronoscope, a television journal of the important issues of the hour, brought to you every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. A presentation of the Longines Whitnor Watch Company, maker of Longines, the world's most honored watch, and Whitnor, distinguished companion to the world-honored Longines. Good evening. This is Frank Knight. May I introduce our co-editors for this edition of the Longines Chronoscope? Mr. William Bradford Huey, editor of the American Mercury, and Mr. Donald I. Rogers, an editor of the New York Herald Tribune. Our distinguished guest for this evening is Mr. Louis V. Sutton, president of the Carolina Power and Light Company. The opinions expressed are necessarily those of the speaker. Mr. Sutton, a few weeks ago, we had Mr. Oscar Chapman, the interior secretary, on our panel, and he presented for us the government's role in the production of electric power. Now, I know you, as a representative of private industry, have a very strong position on that. Could you tell us what it is, sir? We are opposed to further encroachment of the private power business by the government. Do you feel that there's a sinister influence when you say you have such opposition? I do. What is that? The private electric companies have built up a great industry. We are serving the people efficient, well, one of the few industries where the product has not cr increased over the years. We are big taxpayers. You and mean where the price has not increased? The price has not increased. And we 